Hey guys, it's Andrew, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another unboxing video. Today I ended up getting another one of my albums that I ordered throughout my big entire, like, not really shopping spree, but just kind of my big order. So another one came in, and I'm pretty sure this is my um, Omega X album. This is the um, one of the versions of their What's Going On album that I did not get. So, because I, I do have one of their versions. Um, I don't exactly, I don't know the names of the versions for like any albums very well, but I know this one's the blue one and I have the red one already, so whichever ones those ones are, that's what I have. So, um, I, as you can tell, I got it through Amazon, so for those of you who are wondering, I do get majority of my albums from Amazon just because, you know, they can be pretty cheap and, you know, pretty good, so recommend that. Um, as you guys can tell, I'm, I'm definitely in a different, um, like, just, like, spot or location, I guess. For those of you who are new, new to my channel, I normally film in my room, but, um, we're back here in the OG, uh, location where I first started my reactions and started, like, really uploading on my channel. So, I'm down in my basement, so just because there's some stuff going on upstairs, it's just, like, really messy. So, that's why we're going down here. But, um, anyways, this is the album that I got for Omega X, so it's the blue one, so, um, let's see, oh, I don't really like how they put the sticker over that, okay, it's okay, but, um, this is one of the albums that I, like, that I very don't like the packaging for, just because it's, like, very, I don't know, it's just, like, what are you supposed to do with the packaging, you know, so, um, yeah, just not a huge fan of the packaging overall. Uh, what I have done for my past, uh, like my past Omega X one that I got, was I just cut off the top, just like so, and I just keep the rest of it in the bag because you guys will see in a minute. Boom! It's like literally just the photo book, the CD, and then that's it. So, and it's like you know, I never really like keeping the photo book and the CD separate from each other, you know, unless it's like I don't know. So that's what I do. I I keep the bags, and plus it also says what's going on, and it has the official sticker for um, Comica. So I figured, you know, I I've done. There's a very few albums that I have that I've done this, but I've done this for. Omega X is what's going on album as well as a couple of Rocket Punches albums. So, but um, here are some stickers that we get. Um, I already have um, a set of these just because of the past album that I got, but this says EFS. Um, I know that it's gonna be mirrored, so I apologize, but this is Bylacon OX, which is their B side. This is WGO. <laughs> Also, I, I apologize for the lighting. Um, I know it's not necessarily the best. That's why I stopped filming down here like a long time ago. But it's got that cool one. And then we got OX with a... Cool. So that's what we've got for stickers. So now we're going to get on to the actual everything else. So as far as the CD goes, um, it's just in one of the jewel cases. And uh, CD wise, it's pretty simple. Pretty much all of them look like this. It just says what's going on, and then whatever color that it is, that's what the rest of the CD is. Like all the little like decorations, and then it does have one of these stickers that says, you know, the um, I guess the like uh, provider, the distributor. Which for this specific album, it's uh, Dana Entertainment. So, so got that. So that's the CD. Very simple. I, w I will say the jewel case is not in the best condition, like it is cracked, but that's another thing about Amazon is even though the albums are very, very cheap, you kind of have to deal with how they're not going to be necessarily in the best condition just because of, you know, their shitty packaging, like, protocols and everything, but since how this, you know, I wanted to have like at least one good one, that's why I got the other one off of a uh, different, like actual official K-pop website, so. But um, as far as the photo book goes, let's see what we got here. So take out the, the like inclusions. So yeah, the photo book even too is like a little bit messed up. But like I said, 
Amazon, what do you expect? So, and a lot of my albums, anyways, are kind of destroyed anyway, so it's like, it's like I can deal with it, you know? I'm not necessarily the type of person that's like, I have to have a good, um, a good album. And honestly, I don't even know what the, I'm, this is like gonna be the first time I'm ever looking at these kinds of photos because I never really paid attention, so. For those of you who are new to my channel, I don't really typically show all the photos. I just show like a few that I like. So like, there's Zen. Because for those of you who are new to my channel, I'm not an unboxing channel, okay? So y'all will have to like kind of bear with me here. <laughs> but they looked really good, this comeback though. I really liked this comeback a lot. So there's k -Dong. Hans Yeoman and John Moon is really good. I really like Hans Yeoman this hair color. I love how he like kept it for a good portion of the debut and comebacks. Ooh, I really like Hyuk's outfit here. Look at that. I really like that. That's a really nice outfit. Oh wow, and even Yechan. These are some aesthetic photos. I don't even remember like ever seeing any of these online. That's so surprising. Not gonna lie, I don't like the shorts though. I don't know if I've mentioned this in any of my other previous unboxing videos. I feel like I have, or a reaction video. But I don't like when when male idols wear shorts because for whatever reason they just look very weird to me. But I don't know. that's just my opinion. But yeah, so, besides it being like a little bit damaged, honestly, it's not that bad. And also, I never really take out my albums, you know, so the fact that they just kind of stay in the shelves for like 99% of their like lifespan, it's just like, eventually, with them being mixed in with other albums, it'll get put back in shape and it will look a lot more better, so. But with that being said, let's look at our inclusions. So, let me see. We get some stickers, which I think... I don't know if these are different compared to the other version stickers or not. I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know if they're different. I know the sheet's a different color because it's blue, obviously. Because the other one was red. I just don't necessarily know if these are different stickers. But we're gonna have to check them out. So, these will all go into the sticker box, just like um, how my other stickers are, which I just recently made my own sticker box. And we get one photo card and one big, uh, like, flimsy card, which for the flimsy card, I got Sabin, which I'm super excited for because Sabin, I don't have anything of him yet, so I'm really, really happy that I, this is my first thing of, of his. And, um, I, I did go to their concert in, when they came to Chicago, and Sabin and I, we were, like, vibing a lot together, so... Kind of exciting that we I finally got something of him. Um, so we got that. And then for the photo card, looks like we got... Let's see, let me just make it have a co like confirmation. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Jungmoon. So, got Jungmoon. This is my, I think, second photo card of his. Sorry, I'm like trying to see where... I think it's the lighting. But that's my... This is my second ever Jungmoon photo card, I think. So, that's pretty cool. I just want to get like more variety of members just because you know there's like 11 members but I think overall with all the albums of theirs I have I think I only have like five members photo cards so I want to try and get some different members but that was pretty cute that was pretty cool it's a short unboxing video um because I forgot that I didn't get the poster but um that's pretty much all I have for you guys for today I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini unboxing video like I said, I've been trying to do some different videos for you guys every single time I order or I receive an album. I've been trying my best to um, film a video for you guys so you guys can enjoy it. Um, that way you guys aren't always getting the same reaction videos all the time. So I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this unboxing video. If you did, make sure to have a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. And comment down below if you haven't already. Um, I kind of messed up my outro, whoops. Um, and also look forward to some more unboxing videos in the future because I do have um, my al the latest uh, DKZ album as well as one of Seventeen's and Ode albums out right now. I bought those both, so expect unboxing videos for those. But yeah, I'll see you guys very soon. Bye guys. Come to